Hey folks, this is IOE Thrower back with some more World of Tanks. As you can see, this is World of Tanks winner. And he is in his Rhyme with Scorpion. This is a tier 8 game on steps. And uh, yeah, this should be a lot of fun. Uh, this is a premium German tankster. Um, as evident by the beautiful camo and paint job it's got. Because obviously scorpions aren't actually mounted on it. Um, and so yeah. Um, for those of you who didn't know, I was gone for a while, my work got crazy, busy, and I just couldn't deal with it and World Tanks, and videos, and streaming and everything, so I stopped doing everything but working and sleeping and a little bit of gaming at night just before I fell asleep kind of thing. Um, and so now I'm back now that work has calmed back down again, and we're obviously getting right into the gameplay as we've already hit. At least one guy, though, maybe we, uh, um, I think well, we might hit the one guy. I wasn't really paying attention there for a second. Um, oh yeah, just stick that, that front half it. Oh, I thought for a sec that went to the rock, but it just barely missed the rock and sang in that beautiful flank. And there goes the Progetto 46, because he wasn't paying attention. He wasn't quite where he should have been, and because of that, he died. That's really the way it goes with this game. <laughs> if you're not where you should be, you're going to have problems. Um, so we know that Bad Chat is somewhere along that bush line. Uh, he's definitely lighting us every time we, uh, we fire from here. Um, and he's... Well, apparently he's not on that end. And either he's, like, just popping up for a second and then rolling back into cover and, like, doing that constantly. Or he's sitting somewhere that we didn't think... Oh, hello, Mr. Yak 8.8. Unfortunately, not enough time to aim that shot, and thus it went wide. Uh, enemies are doing a, a strong push up the 9 line, and so... We're going to flip around and get over towards that side of the map. Turns out the, uh, the bat chat is dead now, so now that we no longer need the, uh, the spot to be safe, it's uh, now safe. And we have a clear line of fire at the 8.8 .8 from here. Ooh. Also a clear line of fire back at us. Thankfully, he didn't know we were there, so he wasn't firing at us. Yeah, he was looking at the Progetto 46. And the projector was getting out of there, so we didn't actually get spotted by him. Um, looking to not get shot, rolling up into that bush is a great way to get shot, though, because he's not going to be able to fire from there and stay um, fire from there without going too far. Oh, well, ooh, that was a chance we were willing to take. As it turns out, it was a good one. Yeah, no, this... Okay, for a second there, I thought he was going to fire it at the Oho without being scoped in. And I, I thought that I'd, like, messed up the controls and that was in free cam instead of... No, no. That was just... He was just aiming at it uh, <laughs> until he was almost loaded and then he scoped in. He's looking... Oh, I was going to say he was going to look to kill the, um, the SU right in front of him. But when the Pajetto popped up, he couldn't resist that shot. Now, knowing the SU has just fired, we can actually pop around this car and kill him. Except for the fact that we now need, actually really do need to kill this Oho. And our best chance is going to be when he grounds that corner. And so we want to do that. We want to make sure we are loaded for that. Which is why he didn't fire at the SU, by the way. We need to make sure he was loaded for the Oho coming around the corner. Um, now that that's taken care of, he can actually pop out behind the Progetto over here. Oh! Didn't expect an SU-130 back there as well. And because of that, we do get shot in the face for 500 damage, which is uh, just about half of our health. Um, this is going to be a problem because we can only get shot like that once or twice more 
um, before we're gonna really have problems. And that Pichetto is, of course, an auto loader. Ooh, that is the last shot we can take for this game. But thankfully, we are able to roll for it, catch that guy with a shot to his side, and knock him out of this game. Um, with our second last AP round, we're looking. Oh, oh never mind. Oh, donking the shot into the ground. He's got to go, go, go. Ah, 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 juked. Ah, now he's got to get around this guy. This is some medium tank circling action going on right here. Except we're not in a medium tank. Also, if he catches us at all. Oh, yeah. Backing up exactly at the right time to juke the guy's shot. And now we're going to reload before him. So we're just going to put a shot straight through him. And that is going to be that duel over with. Yes, good job. Um, as we load up another AP round. One of those rounds that we put into him was an HE round. Um, and so now we're just loading up our last AP round. And looking to take out the Scorpion G. Our counterpart, um, basically. Next. After that, we're going to start to look for that IS-3. Uh, and then finally the Ramatol. Oh, okay. Well, the Scorpion G is dead, so we're going to speed this up a little bit. Because we're going to head over open ground um, in search of that Ramatol by the looks. So he's actually going to bypass the IS-3. Which, I mean, I recommend um, going head to head with an IS-3 when you've got so little health. Probably a bad idea. Our IS-3 doesn't think it's a bad idea. Does it? Gets himself killed even after... Uh, winner has said in the chat, if I can, can I bring the chat back up? Yep. He says, do not push. They still push. They die. That's just how your team works sometimes. Oh, hello, Mr. Ramatol. How would you like one of these on the side? Uh, that was actually an HE round. He switched over on the fly on the way over, and I didn't notice. Oops. That's some bad casting for you. Now we're loading gold because, of course, this next shot has to end the game. If it doesn't, we are going to die <laughs> because there's no way we fire into an IS-3 um, and before he reloads at, or kills us. But apparently he was firing HE because he definitely he hit that guy on the side but didn't kill him. So for some reason, the enemy was firing HE instead of AP. I don't know. Does that mean he was out of rounds? Or does that mean he's an idiot? I don't know. It doesn't really matter. Either way, he's dead. We got the top gun and we carried our team to victory. Let's go see what his stats were. Ace tanker. Of course. We're not surprised. Bruiser. Fire for effect. Two bonds. Mm. High caliber and top gun. Well done. And so other than the, the bat chat and the Brigetto, everyone else that we shot at, we killed eventually. I mean, some of them, I mean, I don't remember, it was it was this one. This was the most epic duel I've ever seen in two <laughs> tank destroyers. It was great. Um, yeah, I, I just can't emphasize how awesome that was. Also, um, what's this guy? No. Mm -hmm. 15 shots fired. Um, yeah, it was this guy. 15 shots fired. Uh, I, I guess it's possible you was out of AP, but I don't think so. You should have had some ammo left. I actually can't remember how much the IS-3 carries, but uh, it's not that much <laughs> in actuality. Um, overall, though, this was a great game for winner, and I really enjoyed it. Thank you so much for saying it in. Uh, I'm going to need more games from you guys. Uh, now that I'm back and I'm doing this stuff again, I need games. And so, yeah, please send me videos. Um, whether it's just an ordinary win or if it's something like this, which is an epic carry. Or something like yesterday, which was a truly legendary carry. Um, I just want games. Please, thank you so much. Uh, and thank you so much to everybody who stuck with me through this gap. And now that we're back... We're going to have some fun. Okay. Um, watch out for my live streams. I'm going to try and do them at least once a week until 
my work schedule eats up a little bit more, and then I can try and do them twice a week. Uh, for now, Wednesdays are going to be the day. Um, and so, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. This is IOE Throughout.